Hey everyone, it's Susie with Dragonfly Bees. And uh, in this video, I wanted to show you um, if you do own a Presidium Gem Tester 2, there may be times where you need to recalibrate it. Um, perhaps you notice that the needle is not landing where it should be. Maybe um, when it goes to glass, it's kind of off or maybe you changed um, a probe pen or maybe the room uh, is a little cold or it got hot it could be a many different reasons but i will show you how to recalibrate your presidium gem tester 2 correctly now uh, let me just mention that on the side there's these two holes and here they are. I opened up the, the little um, rubber cover and it's labeled C1 and C2. And in there, it's very dark, but there's two discs inside. So what we're gonna do is access the C1 compartment. Um, Presidium doesn't give you a calibration pin. So what I use is basically a wooden stick and all you have to do is press into the C1 hole on the left side. And then when you do that, a blue light, this LED light that's red, will blink blue. And that's when you're ready to start calibrating. I'm going to talk about it first and then show you. Uh, when it blinks blue, you're going to take the probe tip and depress down in the center of the cal disc on top. So when you hold it down, when it um, this unit will beep twice. When it beeps twice, that tells me that the calibration for cal is completed. And then as soon as that's done, this LED light will start blinking green. When it blinks green, you take your probe and depress on the glass disc on top and then when that beeps twice and the LED light is back to red the calibration is completed so let's try this and I will show you what to expect so I'm going to take my little wooden stick and just press it in blue blinking light Press down on Cal. That's done. Wait for the green light. Press down on glass. And we're done. I just recalibrated my Presidium Gen Tester 2. Now, you want to test to make sure that it worked, right? So let me grab some things. You should test something that you know what, what stone it is, of course. So I'm going to press on this. And yes, it went to amethyst. I'm going to press on this. And yep, there goes to diamond. Okay, so I hoped this really helped everyone who does own a Presidium Gem Tester 2. So now you know how to recalibrate your unit and uh, you can test all the gemstones you want. So thanks so much for watching. Press that, uh, give me a thumbs up. Press the like button, ring that bell, that way you'll be alerted for my next new video, and thanks for spending this time with me. Bye now.